Today we're going to start with our word families. Our first word family is our oat word family, like as in the word boat. Can we think of any other words that have the oat sound and rhyme with boat? That's right, goat, note, float. All of those words rhyme with boat and are in the oat word family. Our next word family is the own word family, like the word tone. Can we think of any other words that rhyme with tone? That's right. Our words groan and cone and bone, they all rhyme with tone. So they're in the own word family. Great job. The next thing that we're going to do is I'm going to say a word and I want you to tell me the digraph sound that you hear at the very beginning of the word. Our first word is the word shampoo. What digraph sound do you hear at the beginning of shampoo? That's right, it's the sh sound. Great job, first grade. Our next word is the word chewing. What digraph sound do you hear at the beginning of chewing? That's right, it's the ch sound. Great job, first grade. Our last word is the word third. What digraph sound do you hear at the beginning of third? That's right, it's the th sound. Great job, first grade. Now, I'm going to give you some sounds and I want you to help me put them together to make a word. I have sh, a, v. Sh, a, v. And when I put all of those sounds together, I get the word shave. Great job, first grade. Our next word is, or our next set of sounds are th, or, n. Th, or, n. And I put all of those sounds together to get the word thorn. Great job. And we'll do one more. Our next set of sounds are ch, e, s, t. And when I put all of those sounds together, I get the word chest. Great job. Now, I'm going to give you a word, and I want you to tell me the sound that you hear in the middle of that word. Our first word is the word weak. W, e, k. What sound is in the middle? That's right, it's our E sound. Great job. Our next word is the word cove. K -o -v. What sound is in the middle? That's right, it's our O sound. And our last word is the word bike. B -i -k. What sound is in the middle? That's right, it's our I sound. Great job, first grade. Now I'm going to give you a word and we're going to chop it together into all of the different sounds that we hear. Our first word is the word wrench. So we have er, e, n, ch. Er, e, n, ch. Great job. Our next word is the word brush. B, er, a. Uh, Shh. Great job chopping these words, first grade. And our last word is the word flash. F-l-a-sh. Awesome job. Now I'm going to give you a sound. We're going to put a sound at the beginning and put them together to make a word. Our first word is orth. And I'm going to add n to the beginning. N, orth, and I put them together to get north. Great job. Our next word is I have arm, and I'm going to add ch to the beginning. So ch, arm, together, make charm. Great job. And we'll do one more. Our next word is out, and I'm going to add sh to the beginning. So sh, out, together, give me the word shout. Great job. Now I'm going to give you a word and we're going to take away the very beginning sound and I want you to tell me what we have left over. Our first word is the word such, such. And if I take away that s sound, what do I have left? That's right, I have the word uch left over, great job. 
Our next word is the word thing. Ing. And if I take away, what do I have left over? That's right, I have ing left. Great job. And our last one is if I have the word shown, sh, own, and I take away the sh sound, what do I have left? That's right, I have own left over. Great job. And now, instead of just taking away that beginning sound, we're going to change it to make a new word. Our first word is the word heat. Huh, eat. And if I take away that huh sound, and I put the s sound for s eat, I get the word seat. Great job. Our next word is the word cope. K ope. And if I take away that k sound and I put the s sound, I get s ope. So, great job. And we'll do one more. Our last word is the word like. L ike. And if I take away that ul sound and I change it for the b sound, I get b, ike, bike. Awesome job, first grade.